The Extreme Accuracy Tasked Ordnance Self-Steering Bullet is poised to redefine the role of a sharpshooter. Conceived in the 2000s, the concept not only offers troops in the front line enhanced capabilities, but also guarantees safety when engaging a far-off target. The Exacto Bullet, developed by DARPA, has already been tested against natural phenomenons that were otherwise insurmountable for a regular sniper, and it can outmaneuver wind and dust, conferring almost superhuman abilities to a human element. As the industry awaits the deployment of this remarkable piece of military technology, Exacto promises to harness the power of precision-guided missiles, all within a tiny bullet. Going miniature. The job of a military sniper is exceptionally challenging as it is, but considering the added difficulty of acquiring moving targets in less than favorable conditions like the howling winds and sandy landscapes of Afghanistan, current technology has proven insufficient. Any missed shot represents a significant risk of exposure, as it can give away the troops' position and precise location, thus compromising their safety. It is critical that snipers be equipped with the latest technology to enable them to engage enemies faster and with relatively unerring accuracy. That said, regular bullets have not changed much since their conception, and they currently are as straightforward as ever. But that may change pretty soon. With the idea of creating a supergun that fires bullets capable of curving in mid-air, the Defense Advanced Research Projects Agency, or DARPA, initiated a program that can allegedly do more than simply turn the projectile's trajectory. The Extreme Accuracy Tasked Ordnance, or Exacto project, started in late 2008, led by DARPA and its partners Lockheed Martin and Teledyne Scientific and Imaging. Their main objective was to create a high-precision, long-range rifle that could fire smart bullets, basically enhanced projectiles with the ability to execute complex tasks other than following a given trajectory. In fact, this type of ammunition can turn, change speed, or even send data when fired from a precision-guided firearm capable of programming its behavior. Although the concept is certainly not new, the breakthrough lies in the scale of the shell, as it aims to be a miniaturized type of precision-guided munition. High tech. The primary goal of the highly classified Exacto program is to revolutionize rifle accuracy and range. Seeking to improve effectiveness and maximize safety, the Exacto bullet will allow a more considerable shooter range and a reduction in target engagement timelines, all inside a 50 caliber bullet. Exacto is also the first ever guided small caliber bullet capable of adjusting its course in the air to hit a given target. Nevertheless, there is still no clear explanation of how exactly the bullet works over a decade after its conception. The official description revealed by DARPA uses purposely vague terms, reading, quote, The system combines a maneuverable bullet and a real-time guidance system to track and deliver the projectile to the target, allowing the bullet to change path during flight to compensate for any unexpected factors that may drive it off course. Technology development in Phase 2 included the design, integration, and demonstration of aero actuation controls, power sources, optical guidance systems, and sensors. Still, as DARPA's solicitation maintained, quote, specific system performance objectives, e.g. range, accuracy, and target speed, are classified. Remarkably, the optical sighting technology developed for the project significantly increased its day and night range over current state-of-the-art sniper systems. Moreover, it also stood out as a markedly different approach from the one from Sandia National Laboratories. Researchers from Sandia developed a similar small-caliber guided bullet prototype in 2012. The projectile was capable of steering toward a laser-marked target 1.2 miles away by using an optical sensor on its nose that gathered flight path information. Then, onboard electronics directed tiny fins on its side to redirect the bullet. However, no such fins can be seen on the Exacto round. 
like a pro. In 2014, DARPA released information about the most successful testing of the Exacto bullets. The published footage showed the demonstration of two rounds of live fire testing. The rifle was intentionally aimed to the right of the mark. Packed with tiny sensors, the bullet rapidly changed course in mid-air, veering its trajectory to strike the target. Even though DARPA did not disclose the actual distance, the agency stated that the technology would considerably extend the range of current sniper systems. It is said that the weapon successfully met DARPA's original solicitation that the bullet could, quote, counter environmental effects such as crosswinds and air density, and prosecute both stationary and moving targets while enhancing shooter covertness. While it was speculated that the tiny projectile used fins that shoot out of its body to redirect its path, the developers have not revealed delicate information about the inner workings. DARPA only affirmed that it includes, quote, new approaches and advanced capabilities to improve the range and accuracy of sniper systems beyond the current state of the art. Still, the innovative technology does compensate for environmental forces as well as the movement of the target. In fact, as the test demonstrated, the weapon might allow even a mediocre shooter to perform like a professional sniper, not to mention the enhanced benefits that such an outstanding piece of equipment could provide to a capable marksman. In footage from the test, an experienced shooter and a novice using the system for the first time were both able to hit a moving target. However, the veteran managed to do it on repeated occasions. Range The Pentagon currently needs a vastly improved rifle, and DARPA recently reported that the use of snipers has ballooned in recent years. As sharpshooter training is both extensive and expensive, an upgraded gun might help reduce the procedure. More often than not, snipers are unable to take a shot due to weather-related factors, coupled with a lack of confidence in their own ability to either hit the target or flee if detected. The new long-range rifle could ease their shortcomings. Current sniper equipment can regularly hit trucks at a distance of 2,000 meters, but that cannot be said of smaller and moving targets. Captain Keith Bell, former commander of the Army Sniper School at Fort Benning, Georgia, offered some insight into the mysterious bullet. Quote, the Exacto would be revolutionary. It will more than double our range, and probably more than double our accuracy. There's no limit as far as I can see, so long as the bullet's stable. I think 2,000 or 2,500 meters is very attainable. And although the cost of the advanced rounds is still undisclosed, they are expected to be cheaper than rocket-propelled missiles, which they could conveniently replace in some roles. The Impossible The remarkable technology behind the self-steering Exacto bullets offers a promising future. If the munition alone can tackle wind, dust, and the myriad factors that diminish a sniper's accuracy, while also lowering the chances of a missed shot and the risk of exposure, the human behind the rifle might become unstoppable. Furthermore, the program strived to enhance troop safety by enlarging the shooter's standoff range and reducing target engagement timelines simultaneously by using fire-and-forget technology previously found in larger projectiles, such as the Harpoon missile. And while small-caliber smart munitions might not be widely available for several more years, the program has pushed the concept further than ever. In the words of program manager Jerome Dunn, quote, True to DARPA's mission, Exacto has demonstrated what was once thought impossible, the continuous guidance of a small-caliber bullet to target. This live-fire demonstration from a standard rifle showed that Exacto is able to hit moving and evading targets with extreme accuracy at sniper ranges unachievable with traditional rounds. Dunn also expressed that fitting such sophisticated guidance capabilities into a tiny 50 caliber size was a major breakthrough in the industry and a milestone that, quote, opens the door to what could be possible to future guided projectiles across all calibers. Thank you for watching Dark Tech. If you enjoyed our video, please give us a thumbs up and don't hesitate to check out all our other Dark Documentaries channels. 
with more stories about the technological and military marvels of our time. Also, click on the bell icon to be notified about our newest content. And stay tuned.